Hello everybody, Kevin Savatella here with One Team Realty. I'm out here in St. Cloud, Florida, checking out the community Prairie Oaks. And today we're checking out the builder called Cardell Homes. Now Cardell Homes is kind of known outside of Central Florida, not too big in Central Florida yet, but they build a lot in the Tampa area and they tend to build a little bit more of a luxury home. So here now, they actually brought a more affordable product. So today we're gonna to be checking out the Cypress floor plan. It is just over 2,000 square feet with a four bedrooms and two bathrooms. Now in this community, you do have a playground, you got a pool and cabana. And you're also close to the awesome town as of Lake Nona. So if you haven't seen my video on Lake Nona, you guys gonna have to check that one out. I'll put it right there for you guys. But in the meantime, please come on in and enjoy the tour. Okay, so here we go to check out the Cypress floor plan. Now, as you can see there, it is 2,014 square feet, four bedrooms, two baths. And so you can see here that they do do a brick paver driveway, which is pretty nice. They have higher ceilings inside. So it's a lot of nice luxury features that they include in these homes. Now, this particular home currently starts at $469,990. So let's go on in and check it out. Now it is a model home, so it is pretty nice and upgraded. So keep that in mind as we're touring this house. Now, right off the bat, you got a nice wide foyer coming in. They did do the upgraded tray ceiling in the foyer, which is amazing. Definitely with those lights too, just a perfect touch. And then coming over this way, you do have a bedroom right over there. You got a bathroom there. And then we have another bedroom here. Now, the sales lady is working out of that office right now, so we're not going to disturb her there, but just your normal bedroom. Then right here, you do got a linen closet. Then as we proceed over here, you do got a full bathroom for your guests. Pretty nice shower with tiles all the way up to the ceiling. That's probably an upgrade, but definitely a nice upgrade worth thinking about doing. And right over here, we got another bedroom. Now, some people like these kind of closet doors. Some people don't, but it's the ones that you just have to pull. It's not like a knob to turn it. It's not sliding doors, it's just pull. The nice thing about them is that you can open up the whole thing. So it's like that's nice and open versus the other ones you gotta like slide it and then you can open up only one side of the door so pretty nice little details matter sometimes and like i said that is a bedroom there we're just not going to check it out since they're working but continuing on this way right there we have the garage and then right over here we do have what seems like a coat closet because it only has one shelf. Usually linen closets will have multiple shelves, but if you wanted to make it a linen closet, you just add some more shelves since we're in Florida, we don't use coat closets much. And then right over here, we have another regular bedroom. I would say this one will be a good like guest bedroom because it is further away from the, or sorry, not guest bedroom, but like office or guest bedroom too, since it's further away from the main bathroom. But it's definitely a pretty nice size. Then right over here, we do have the laundry room. So right over there will be the washer and dryer. They don't come included, but you see you got nice cabinetry all, all around that you could choose to upgrade if you want. Now over there's the AC unit. And then there is an optional door you can add from your master bedroom closet if you want to get in and out of the laundry room nice and easily. Definitely a good option, but it does take away from some shelving space, so keep that in mind. Then continuing right over here, we got to check out this kitchen because definitely pretty nice main living space. Now check out that island. This island is huge. Now the camera never does it great justice, but it is definitely deeper than your normal builder island. So pretty nice there. Nice modern cabinets. 
Um, definitely the crown molding is a little bit more unique than I've seen out there. So it is like a new modern style, I'm assuming. Pretty cool. That's the thing I like about going to these model homes and showing you guys these model homes too. Just, you see different things all the time. You learn new new design trends and everything. But right here, you got a pretty good sized pantry. Definitely if you got some kiddos or anything, works very well. And right over here, we have our dining room. And then right here is two optional windows. So if, just keep that in mind. If you're seeing this video, you see, wow, a lot of pretty windows. Now those two are an upgrade, so keep that in mind. But yeah, definitely a pretty nice dining space. And then right over here, you got your main living area. Definitely pretty large. You can see on that side, you got some space still. And then over there is your entrance to your master bedroom. But definitely you can put a lot more furniture here for entertaining. Put a, you could put a big sectional right over here, whatever you want, get creative here. And then we'll take a peek out back. Now out back, it does have an optional cover lanai. Um, usually you get a little concrete slab that's included, but we're in Florida, definitely keep in mind if you want a cover lanai, something good to add. But we'll take a look at it. And I do love these triple sided doors, they're pretty big. But this optional lanai is definitely a good size. Especially if you want to do some outdoor entertaining, or just hang out outside. Definitely a good thing to add on on your house. I always highly recommend it. Now we'll go check out the master. Now the master looks amazing. Take a look. Very nicely decorated. Lots of windows, but keep in mind those two windows are an upgrade. You do get this back window already included, but those two will be enough. As you can see, it's definitely a good size, plenty of space. You see you got a key size bed, easily two nightstands, and then there's still some more space left over as well. Now, right here, you do got a good dresser wall. You can put your TV right above. And then I know couples like to fight over storage space. If you wanted to easily over there, you could put a dresser chest and still have plenty of space as well. Now we'll take a look into the master bathroom. Master bathroom is pretty nice. You got a nice big window right in the middle. I think that one actually comes included. And I do like how it has different mirrors. Usually sometimes they put one big mirror or something like that. This looks a little bit better to me. Something a little bit different. And then right over here, let me turn on this light. You do get a nice size shower. They did do the upgraded frameless glass enclosure with the tiles all the way up to the ceiling. If you do have that option to put tiles all the way up to the ceiling, do it. It looks so much better. It might cost you a few extra hundred bucks, but definitely looks a lot better. And then right next to that, you do have your toilet room. And then over here is your master closet. So remember the optional door to the laundry room that I was telling you guys about? There it is. <laughs> so if that's something important to you, that is good. Just keep in mind, usually this wall will have extra shelving space. And then if you wanted to, you could put more over here. So that does take away from a little bit of shelving space, but hey, it is a nice quick walk to the laundry room. So that is pretty good. Thank you guys for watching today's video with me today. I had a great time showing you around this home by Cardell Homes. Now Cardell is a little bit of a higher end builder, so keep that in mind. But if you do want those upgrades and lots of nicer features, then Cardell might be the one. But if you want to save a little bit more money, there are some other builders with lower prices. So just depending on what you want, there's different options for you in this area. Now a little bit about this location, you are probably about 10, 15 minutes away from Lake Nona, which is probably the fastest growing area in all of Central Florida with lots of big jobs coming in. Disney is even putting their corporate headquarters there in the next three years or so, two, three years. That's already in the works. So 
lots of things to do with the family and everything. So if you haven't seen my Lake Nona video, you definitely got to check that out. And but in the meantime, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care. Bye bye.